Hey guys, how are you today? I wanted to make a quick video. Uh, I know people were saying that you couldn't use uh, the the Jevy, uh, excuse me, the R SIM on a XR or XS Plus, and I just kind of want to show you that it can be done. I don't know if you can see right here. It is saying track, uh, excuse me, track phone. Okay, TFW. So it is working. Um, and one of the tricks is too that you gotta double check that it's on. 12.2 so this is an iPhone XR okay just so you can see and it is on 12.2 so I'm using an R SIM people are saying you have to use an R13 and all this stuff and it is true but guess what I only have the R12s so I've been using the R12 now all you have to do is a little trick because the SIM tray is upside down so all you have to do is take your R12 okay SIM card the little computer chip at the bottom and it has that little tail you just have to bend that little tail over so basically you take your sim card here and you match it up to where that cut is and that little tail part that's normally there you just have to kind of just fold it over so it's nicely nicely tucked in then all you have to do is take that little tray and pop it in here okay and so that little tail is kind of like I don't know if you could see that it's kind of tucked in there into the metal and you want to keep it so it looks exactly like it's right on the tray you don't have to glue it down or anything just hold it pretty tight and then all you're gonna do is just gonna gently slip it in there now just to show you that this is working okay we're gonna put an AT&T one because this was Sprint, so we'll put an AT&T here, and you'll see that it's locked. Because I already programmed this one already, um, but I just wanted to make a video so it goes to the hello, okay? And this is Simple Mobile, T-Mobile, just to kind of show you as well. And I have a lot of other videos where I show you how to. Do the program settings i could probably just show you real quick on this one but you pop this chip in boom hello okay so what we're gonna do and just so you can see it you know what let me just do that real quick for you let's say i was going to program this actually i think it should probably even already work either way but i'll show you so take your sim card where the cut is Pop this in here. Okay. Try to get it exactly how it looks. So it looks like it's covering it ex exactly. And we're going to take this. And I'm just going to gently slip it in there. And you're going to see that it should go to the hello screen okay and with the XR to get to emergency screen hold the hold the hold this soft button slide it up emergency and you're gonna press star five zero zero five star seven six seven two star zero pound talk it's gonna give you this edit ICC ID okay this is the latest ICC IC ID excuse me but you know this videos get older we'll, we'll update it in the description but that's the latest right now the 0935 you hit basically you hit send um, and then it already you it will ask you to hit accept but we already did that already so for the sake of video we won't do that but you'll basically press the power and the soft button the down button soft button slide to power off and that basically will shut off turn it back and then you'll turn it back on again and it'll go it'll ask you to um, choose a Wi-Fi network and, and then it'll activate so actually let's uh, let's do that real quick so you'll basically you'll shut this down turn it back on again uh, and again I've made other videos you can Check my uh, my other videos. You'll see like full, but I'm trying to do one here for you just in case. 
this is the first time you're seeing you know this process for the XR so I'm trying to go through the full motions okay so I'll bring you here you'll hit hello you'll click continue uh, I'm already connected to Wi-Fi but if you weren't it would ask to connect to a Wi-Fi and then see what happens it should go through but an event that it, yeah okay so look so with the 18 so this was the AT&T so it did go directly it said it's gonna say no service because this sim card has no service but now all you have to do if you do want to switch it because I actually have the sim card that I want to use that's active that we saw before that wouldn't work without the RSIM. So now all you have to do now, and again, there's a lot of videos out there that say, you know, you just, you're stuck, but that's all you have to do is just flip that over. Okay, fold that over. Pop this in the tray. It's not that tricky once you, once you get a hang of it. Okay, kind of line it up, a little pressure. Pop that in. And when you change the sim, it will ask you to, to continue update. So just update it again. Unable to activate. Okay, try again. All right, let's click next. Maybe it didn't have internet. Looks like it's gonna go through. see the signal bars pop up it's a good sign boom there you go track phone see that track phone all right guys if you like this video uh, please give me a, a like subscribe and uh, let me know if you have any questions send me a comment but this was an XR a lot of videos show you that R12 they won't work this was the uh, the R12 that I used and uh, it, it works. You just have to do that little trick. Make sure it's on 12.2. Thanks, guys. Have a great day.